Okay, here we have one of these wind up torches. It's very battered because it's missing some teeth on the gearbox. As you can see, there's a nuff bar, that duff patch. Another duff patch up here where it's missing a teeth or two. Um, I'm going to see what's inside it. Plus, it's very, very sad looking. Uh, fuck knows where it's been, but uh, one click, believe it or not, actually gets one LED going off, on, again, I guess all three of them going. See if I can get you on there, probably not. No, but I've never seen inside one of these before, so I thought today would be the opportunity, since I've now got a lot of time on my hands, so why not? So I had to go and look for some very small screwdrivers because these screws are very small and they're in about half a mile in so I'm going to open it up and see what's inside it it may take a couple of attempts but I don't know what's inside it so we'll open it up and have a look then shall we no, I'll try to do a time lapse but apparently it was too small the file so um, not really sure how you get into it No, I don't get these bloody screws out. Guessing this comes out. I don't know. We're going into a weak bit. Do not tell me it's welded. There it is. It's a bit welded together. Oh, it's open now. It was just a second ago. Oh, okay, yeah. Ah. Right. Okie dokie. So, what have we got? Not a lot. So, we've got the... Start from the front. We've got the reflector and lens. Uh, I don't want that. Get rid of it. Was not expecting a motor to be in here. That's fine, we can have some fun with that. Crank it up until it pops, probably. Won't probably take that many volts, but we'll see. So you've got three LEDs, obviously one click obviously does the centre LED. Turn it off, and then on again, that does all three. So, standard, you've got a... Probably a controller, or whatever that is. Momentary switch, three resistors, and I think this is it for under here, but I could be wrong. Take this little screw out. And uh, under there, you've got your live in, live out, for you, uh, live in, neutral in from your battery pack, which is probably some lithium cells. And then you obviously got your live and neutral. But these haven't been phase allocated, so you don't know which one's live, which one's neutral. Unless you look at the tracks, but that's easy. Um, but, yeah, so you've got your lithium cells, probably 3 volts there, probably. Probably 5 volts or something like that. On that little cell. It's actually got the data written on this pack, if I can uh, get it off. And... Give us a sec, I think. I can't really work it out. 3.6 volt. MH at 40 milliamp hour. See if I can get you on there. There you go, 3.6 volt, 40 milliamp hour, and uh, MH, so. Probably metal oxide. 
Probably because it created a lot of sparks when I swung that one. Not overly. Are you back getting one? No. So uh, we'll snip these connections and uh, actually I'll snip them halfway because I want to have some fun with it for the minute. Got some snips. So, battery pack, this is where I'll probably get belt. Not overly. It's DC, low volt, low milliamps, so I won't give much of a belt. I'm going to have some fun with this in a minute. I don't know what's coming. So yeah, there's a little DC motor there. Nice and fun and all. Um, so if you have a look at the front of the gear, like drivetrain, you can see, oh dear, snapped a tooth. And then a few more teeth. Then it's two snapped teeth. Then probably about five. And then back to your one snapped tooth. So let's actually see what's in here. I can pull it out without busting it. So yeah, you got your 3.6 volt DC electric motor there. <clears throat> A few gears from the drive shaft. And uh, yeah, so... That's how it works without the motor in it. As you can see, if I take this out. You can see that that drive gear's got a lot of teeth missing. If you have a look in the grease, you can see that there's a tooth there, a tooth there, and a few teeth at the bottom here. So, yeah, didn't take much to snap the gears on it, to be fair. A bit disappointed, but hey ho, never mind. Um, so, yeah, all we got is this little DC mode to have some fun with, and uh, we shall. Uh, Probably put it on the dyno run, probably. I don't know. But, uh, very interesting.